Hello my loves, how y'all doing? I hope you guys are doing well. How y'all doing? We're going to another makeup store. Or going to makeup store, yes. Excited? I already chose a look. I'm going to show it to you guys later in the video. And yeah, let's just go. Bye, Zaim. I have only one positive to say about this look. Everything went wrong for some reason. I don't even understand how everything can go wrong. Everything is wrong, okay? So, um, we're gonna see what she does right, and you guys let me know if you think it's true or not. And even that right is not completely right, but it's okay, okay? So, she did add a primer on my face, which is good, but she's using a really disgusting sponge to blend the primer and also blend the foundation, which is, by the way, completely dark. Like, 10 shades darker than me okay i'm exaggerating uh six shades darker than me maybe i don't know it's orange it's brown it's not very orange it's brown but she is gonna blend a lot a lot to the point where it kind of disappears but not really but i'm still orange i'm still tan but not really okay so she doesn't get all the spots as usual under my nose there's no coverage there's no um concealer there's no foundation there's no powder right under my nose i don't know how that happens but yeah we always have we always have a blind spot right over there let's just see what goes on and what goes wrong in this video okay these brows omg it's just a line it's just a line it's just one line i looked at them she's like do you want to fix them in any way i'm like yeah can you make them thicker and she just drew another line right on top of the line okay so the brows didn't change Whew. let me just show you the look that i asked for and this is the palette that she took out i did not bring any palettes today i'm not at home so i don't have any palettes with me and the look is just so beautiful but this is not it and she didn't even start with the look she started with the uh, doing my eyeliner she did my bottom liner which is okay it's fine it's fine <laughs> Okay, she made a mistake with the mascara and she put it on my cheek and she's trying to remove it with a dry um, tissue that's not how you're gonna remove mascara like that it's just making a bigger mess it's now a nice dark spot under my eyes and then she's putting eyeliner liquid liner on my eyebrows so i did ask her can you put the liquid liner on my lids 
later on but she did it right now guys she did the liquid liner before the eye li before the eyeshadow okay guys and i was like oh my god oh my god oh my god what's happening oh my god oh my god everything is just backwards here okay backwards you'll see you'll see the line is not great but it's not the worst no it's bad it's bad you can't even it's bad okay it's bad it's not even opaque okay Just in case you forgot the look, here's the look again. Okay, it's a really shiny lid. It's just shiny, so shiny, so beautiful. Now the colors she's using are just not of the same quality. Okay, they don't have the same shine. Okay, they don't have the same reflection. Okay, so it just looks kind of grayish and dull on my eyes. And she added a blue, which I don't know why. Because the eye has a darker outer corner, a beautiful darker outer corner. But it's very minimal. It's just like the whole lid is just covered in this beautiful shine. It was so easy to do. Maybe, maybe not. I have to try it. Do you let me know. Do you think it's an easy look? Um, it's not going to look that shiny. Of course, the picture is edited. But I just wanted the same look. You know, something similar. A similar feel. Okay? Just a shiny lid and just gorgeous lashes and liner. You know? That's what I wanted. That's all I asked for. I can't even see the liner anymore. It's gone! <laughs> Now, I don't even know what's happening here. She's adding concealer right under my eyes, but she just added it on one side of my face. I looked at the palette. It's like a concealer palette, but she already put foundation. She already powdered my face using a sponge. You saw that, you know? So adding another concealer, another creamy product on top of that powder, I don't even know. I don't even know. And she just stopped there. She just did like one side of my face and then she jumped to the top of my brows. I'm not sure what she's really doing okay i'm not sure what she's trying to achieve is it like carving my brows is she carving my brows maybe she is L let me know okay let me know and then she's adding more powder on top of that remember she did not add the concealer to the other side of my face she did not even add it under my eyes i don't get it i don't get it i'm confused <laughs> I did ask for blush and highlight but she said she doesn't have blush there and she did have highlight so I've never seen anyone put highlight this way you know the stamping motion see that stamp stamp and then another stamp stamp on the other side and then another stamp stamp on the cheek nothing is truly blended thank god it's just not a lot so you don't see it that much right I don't know on camera i don't see that much in real life you could see it but the color wasn't wrong she actually made me choose and i chose the right color for my face so the color of the highlight isn't wrong at all 
so we got that right and uh, here we go the only thing that i think she did a decent job in in is the lipstick as i said earlier the lipstick uh she's using she was giving on my her own lipsticks but i told her i have my own because oh my god i already feel so icky with the sponge so i just wanted to get home and wash my face so i did give her my own lipstick and this is allure beauty by um allure beauty i don't even know what i'm saying but it's an tanzanian brand it's on instagram if you can if you want to follow them or see them there so the lipstick is okay she had to put another layer a proper layer to actually make it nice and opaque but um she did at least stay inside the lines you know sometimes we go offline or we go inline and she did try okay she's using a tissue to kind of remove every mistake that she did and and i think it's like the most decent job that she did is it perfect no do i have coverage everywhere no but is it bad no okay it kind of saved the look i think in my opinion right do you agree Ciao Maliza. Ciao Maliza. Anti finish. I mean, what can I say? <laughs> look, what if I try to look do a nice pose? Do I look good? What do you think of the brows? Does that look good? Oh, wow, this bro is even better than this one. Whoa. Oh my god. I give this um three? Or three? I don't even know what to say. You let me know in the comments. I give this a three. Maybe I'll have comments when I'm talking through voiceover, but right now I'm just speechless and I need to go wash my face right now. For some reason, it feels sticky. My pimples show even more now that my makeup is on. And I just feel, oh my god. Okay, bye. <laughs> you can see it actually better if I don't have so much light on my face, right? You can see what a mess that is? This is how it looks like nearly in real life. Color is like so wrong for me. <laughs> got to go, got to go wash this off my face. <laughs> Don't forget to subscribe.